please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Handling Bad Pipe File Descriptor When Reading from Stin in Python Introduction In Python, reading from standard input, stin, is a common task, especially when dealing with command line interfaces or processing input from other programs. However, you may encounter a bad file descriptor error when attempting to read from stin under certain conditions. This tutorial aims to explain why this error occurs and provides a solution to handle it gracefully. Understanding the issue The bad file descriptor error typically occurs when trying to read from stin in situations where the input stream has been closed or is not properly available. This can happen when your script is running in an environment where stin is not properly connected, such as when reading from a closed pipe. Code example Let's consider a simple Python script that reads input from stin. If you run this script in an environment where stin is not available or has been closed prematurely, you might encounter a bad file descriptor error. Handling the bad file descriptor error to handle this error gracefully, you can check whether stin is a valid file descriptor before attempting to read from it. Here's an updated version of the script with error handling. In this version, sys.stin.isati is used to check if stin is associated with a terminal. If it is, it means there is no input from a redirected file or pipe, and a message is displayed accordingly. Conclusion by checking the validity of the stin file descriptor before attempting to read from it, you can gracefully handle the bad file descriptor error in your Python scripts. This ensures that your code is more robust when dealing with various input scenarios. Chat GPT Title, Handling Bad File Descriptor Error When Reading From Stin In Python Introduction When working with input from the standard input, Stin, in Python, you might encounter a bad file descriptor error. This error typically occurs when attempting to read from a closed or invalid file descriptor. In this tutorial, we'll explore common scenarios leading to this error and provide solutions to handle it gracefully. Scenario 1, Closing Stin Prematurely In this example, we attempt to read from Stin after closing it explicitly. This will result in a bad file descriptor error. Solution 1, check if stin is open before reading. By checking if sys.stin.closed is true before attempting to read, we can avoid the bad file descriptor error. Scenario 2, redirecting stin from a file. In this example, we redirect stin to a file, and then attempt to use the input, function. This can lead to a bad file descriptor error. Solution 2, use sys.stin.buffer for file operations. By using sys.stin.buffer.readline.decode.strip, instead of input, we can handle stin redirection without encountering the bad file descriptor error. Conclusion Handling the bad file descriptor error when reading from stin in Python involves checking if stin is open before attempting to read. Additionally, when stin is redirected to a file, using sys.stin.buffer can prevent this error. By applying these solutions, you can write more robust code when dealing with standard input in Python. ChatGPT